Today we are going to go over making a um, knot for um, our heat cure um, cow tube. So first we're going to start off, we have all the tools here. We got an impact drill, we got two hose clamps or scissors, a torque wrench, and some duct tape. We've already made our, our measurements here. So we got our cow tube, we got on our cow tube, we got two feet of cow tube past our liner and then we have one foot for our knot. Um, so we're gonna make, you start off by making a knot in your lay flat hose. very end of it you're gonna lay you're gonna lay your knot right in the middle of your one foot section and then you're gonna take this over fold that and Steve is gonna help me Go ahead and hold that there bud and we're gonna put some duct tape and we're gonna start off at our one foot mark which we have right there and what you're gonna do is just keep it, keep it flat. And the reason why we're putting cal um, duct tape on here is to actually uh, protect it um, when we apply, uh, put our hose clamps on. So our knot is sitting about halfway in between our one foot section. We're going to take our hose clamp and we're going to put our first hose clamp on the back side of our knot. knot here and our hose clamp is going to be right behind it. Cinch that down. Torque it down. Steve real quick and we're gonna just uh, take this one little all right so we got our first hose clamp down now we're gonna get our pull strap same thing we're gonna put a knot at the end of this pull strap and we're gonna fold this over and you're not still here and your hose clamp is still behind here. So we're gonna take that. Time. Just do a quick loop. We're gonna stick. Now we want that knot to sit back here so we can actually add another hose clamp. So that's where we're not sitting in the far back and we're gonna put another hose clamp right back here. So let's uh, open that up.
All right, so we got our knot on our pull strap. On the far back, we got that uh, the hose clamp in front of that. Now, what what that does is when you pull this pull strap out when you're pulling the cowl tube out, this knot will protect it if that ever comes. So let's just say it comes loose, their whole thing. Well, that hose clamp will hold it, and you won't have an issue in your strap breaking. Pull this forward. Go over your hose clamp a couple times. Now that we have our <clears throat> our lay flat hose and our strap um, and our knot done, make sure that you guys put your slits in your lay flat hose. And this is where you're gonna be introducing the water down at the far end of that liner. I usually put four or five. Um, if you got a longer run, you can also definitely add more, but we'll do four today. So this is your fail safe 